Hello, everybody. Welcome back. This is Tinker77, and we are again on the QTech world. Last time, we had worked on some things with the energy and the solar panels. And in the meantime, this has been working. And I'm almost done. It's only got 340 pieces left to mine. Everything's going great. Now, this did fill up. As you can see, it's really close to full now. I took a lot of the iron out and coal and redstone. So there might be some in here, a little redstone and coal and some iron. But for the most part, it's in these other two chests. So this thing is working great. And so I thought the next thing we would try to do is some refined storage so we can get our kind of like our storage system done. But of course, there is a rabbit hole for that. The first piece you're going to need, of course, would be the controller. And the controller here, this is quartz enriched iron. We can make that. This just takes uh, uh, this stuff here. We can make most of this already. Um, but the problem is, if you look at the silicon, um, it takes, you can only make it with the dissolution chamber. Okay. So we definitely need to make that. That is something we have to get pretty quickly. So let's look at this. And if you look at this piece, most of this is gold and uh, diamond and buckets and chests and stuff, but you have plastic. So we have to get plastic and it looks like get that from these sheets. These sheets are from little plastic pellets and the plastic pellets you get from a solidifier taking polyethylene. And how do you get polyethylene? See, it's this huge rabbit hole to get what we need. But from polyethylene, you take a mixing thing and it takes water, which we can get from buckets and ethane and ethane you get from refining oil because you diesel and ethane so we're going to have to do something with oil so we need to uh refine oil and we have to be able to pick up the oil so that's the first part today now i think what we're going to do is work with some tanks here so let's go look at it first the tank to put the oil into i was going to look at this basic fluid tank it just takes iron and redstone and of course we have that so let me uh, make a couple tanks here let's get some iron and some redstone that'll work and i want to make uh what do you think two or three tanks will be pretty good probably let's make three tanks that way we can have some we can have empty and some are full or whatever now that's great we have a way to get tanks we need to get a pump we need to pump the the oil out and so when i looked up pump here i saw this as the electric pump this is probably the best thing to use when it takes osmium it takes a steel casing all this stuff, we gotta get those infused alloys in a bucket. Now, do we have any of those things already? Uh, no. <laughs> okay, so we do have a bucket. Yeah, we have these things right here. We need some osmium. There's some osmium. What else do we need for this? A casing here. There's a block of osmium, we have that. And then four wafers and four steel. We have five steel and the wafers. Did we use them all? I think we might have used them all in the last thing. I don't, oops. I don't see them anywhere. Okay, so to make the wafers, uh, what was that? Two coal and two iron, huh? Is it iron dust? Does it have to be iron dust? Hold on. I don't want to, I don't want to mess this up. It takes, no, it takes... Eight coal and eight sand. Right. That's more like it. So we have eight coal. I mean, sorry, eight sand. And... I have some coal in here. Yeah, lots of coal in there. Eight coal. And then we'll make up the pieces that we need here. So this will be awesome. Okay, the other thing I think we need, this is a cell. We could take this with us if it had power. Of course, right now it doesn't have any power because we have been using power uh, a lot here. But this is, should be all powered up. I don't know. So everything's taking power. What's taking so much power? That is, okay. I'm not really worried about this. I'm going to shut down all the usage here for now so that that battery gets uh, powered back up because we want it to come back pretty quick here. There it goes. Okay. We have that. We need our diamond saw. There it is. Okay. And so we're making the casing and then we'll make the pump. Okay. 
Now, this is still getting power. I want that to get more power. Let's see. Can we make another one of those? Um, that, that was with mechanism, right? Isn't that mechanism? Or is that power? No, it's this right here. Basic energy cube. We can make another one of those pretty darn quick. If we had more of those. I don't know. I just need to have enough power to power this. I'm going to take this with me uh, over, to this, over to the place where we're going to be. Let's put in some, um, make some of these. Okay, so we're gonna make another energy cube. Let this one fill up and then we'll put one in its place. So we have to have some gold, which looks like butter. It ain't dark, let's go and rest. Okay, so this is the first thing. We're trying to get all this oil and, and get it into a container that we can bring back here to work with, okay? That's, kind of the key that I'm looking at. So, um, let's see. We need to make two of these. These are energy tablets. There we go. Oops. Pick that up. Okay, and then this is an osmium block. And we need more steel, which is coal and iron. Pretty darn good. We're getting close to this. Then I think we'll take the tanks and the pump and we'll be able to get some of the fluid out, right? And that's what we're trying to do. And this is still gaining power and that's good. It's still daylight. Now on the map, this is our base and we can see that there are this, there's a field here of oil and there's a field up here. Probably this is where we want to go. It's closest one. So we're going to do that in just a sec. As soon as we get some, like, steel. <laughs> Is this going to be enough steel? Probably not. Do we have any steel nuggets in here? We have seven of them. I don't think we have any steel anywhere else. We're still waiting on this steel to make a cell. The energy cube. Get some iron, too. Get one more of those. Okay. We are really close, guys. This is not going to take that long. Just got to wait for this thing to go. Wish I had a time in a bottle. Time in a bottle, if you don't know, would um, is that from another mod, but basically it uh, makes things go faster. You store time in it, and then you use the time on other objects. So there we go. Alrighty, make the casing, make the cell. Excellent. Now we don't need to take with us a lot of this stuff here. We don't need to take any of those resources there. I'll put a lot of this stuff in here for now. And what we really need is just these pieces. I don't even need the diamond saw or that. Okay, so this is getting pretty close to power. I'm going to take it as is. We have one that's mostly powered and one that's not. Make sure that we put this back and we put it to the sides. Basically, the top is input and all the other sides are output. Okay. So there it's loading up and now we have our energy cube. Let's go to that uh, location where there is the oil. We set right up here around this hill. And then we will uh, set up this pump. It should work fine, okay? So we can see there's a field coming up right here. All right, so I'm going to put this energy cube right here. Okay, and all the sides should be still be on output. I'm going to put the electric pump on it against it. And I should be able to just put the tank on here, I think. No. Okay, let me grab this. Maybe it has to attach on the side right there with the energy. It did, and there you go, guys. See that? It's pumping up oil into here. And you can see it's kind of taking it out of here. And that's what we want to see. We want to see this stuff get pulled in here. Because we can take this back and use it. Okay, that one looks like to be full. Put another tank down. So there we go. We have oil. I like to have my oil. There's a chicken in my oil. That's kind of funny. Does it look like it's full? That looks full to me. Ah. Can we go in the oil? Guess we can. We're all like oiled up there. That's kind of crazy. Okay, now, last one. We still have plenty of energy. Okay, excellent. Okay, so let's grab all of this now. 
head back to base. There it is. Okay. So now we've gotten some oil. So now we can work on the other pieces of this puzzle. So let me put this in here for now so we don't lose the oil and the energy cube. Okay. So now we said we needed to get a, I think it was a refinery, right? So we go to the refinery and we need to make this machine here. Okay. It takes all this stuff, which we're going to have to make aluminum steel. We make that with two steel and two aluminum. Therefore it's called aluminum steel. So let's go get some aluminum. that in there let that machine go okay we're going to need empty canisters these are aluminum ingots to make eight of those so we can do that that's uh we're going to need more aluminum so we got our canisters that's good that'll be easy to work with um we need to have electrum and we have plenty of electrum that's good we need a heating element, which is redstone alloy and a, a copper coil. And again, it's these fine copper wires, which are just copper and that tool, this right here, and all our copper, wait, is there some in there? Yes. So, there we go. And we need some iron bars and some iron. There's some iron bars. Okay. We're making all the pieces parts here. Making the heating element. We need some redstone alloy there. There's some aluminum steel. The redstone alloy is iron and redstone. So for each piece, it takes um, four redstone. Okay. So we're going to make four bars of that. Excellent. Okay. Let's go back out here and I want to check this and sort it and take out the coal and take out the iron and take out the redstone and then resort. Okay. We only got seven tungsten. I know we need some tungsten later. It's going to be kind of crazy working with all this with very low resources on part of it. Okay. There we go. Trying to get a refinery. Now with the refinery, when we use the refinery, it, uh, if we take oil, it will give us diesel and it will give us ethane. And that's what we need. We're trying to get at least this far today. See if we can get that material that we're going to need for the refined storage. Now, refined storage, we need a couple of pieces. And let's look a little bit ahead while we're waiting here. We're going to have to do the controller and we should be able to make that pretty quick. This is easy. This is bismuth brass, which is just made from copper and zinc. And bismuth, and we have that. Is that how you say that? So that should be okay. We should be able to make this pretty quick. The other piece we're going to make is a disk drive. And again, it's the same pieces here. So we should make a couple of these frames when we do it. We should make like two of those. And then we're going to need a crafting grid, which takes a grid and takes another machine frame. So we really should make three frames um, when we work on this process, okay? So we have all of that. We need some redstone now to make it the other ingot that we need. Because we do need, let's make sure we're doing this right. We need that um, redstone alloy. Yes. Okay. So we need four of that. Making sure it's not just the red one, you know, it's that it's the right. We need 16. And there we go. Okay. So what else we need here? We need to make this, which is, we're going to need more of that. <laughs> okay. And the green ones are osmium and redstone. So let's make the green ones. I always call them green ones. I know they got a certain other name, but I just always call them the green ones. There we go. Got that working for us. I really need to do a, but just do a batch of these sometime. Maybe we'll let it sit off camera and just batch up like a whole stack of these and a stack of other things that we need so that we don't have to spend so much time during an episode doing this. Okay. And that two of those let's see let's get um trying to get to 10 of those 
There we go. Split it out. And then we're going to need a bunch more of those pieces for the uh, redstone alloy ingots. So we're going to have to make some more of this. So I'll just throw the iron in and I'll throw the redstone in. As soon as this finishes, whenever that is. Yeah, it's going a little bit slow. I know. But that's the way we're going to do this series. So we'll put the iron in. We'll put the redstone in. Let it go to town. Okay, so there we go. We got the heating element. No, we got to make the copper coil, right? Did we make that already? We did not. I thought we made the copper coil. And then we make... There. Copper coil. Or heating element. Sorry. Oh. Well, I've got three of them now. I realized that right after I made it that, hey, I already had one of those. Okie dokie. <laughs> Oh, well, that happens, right? So, circuit board. These three of those. And we got to make this is seven more of this. And we got to make this piece here, which is the blue, which is a red. And two of those. Okay. So, again, the blue one is the red one, which is that. And we have some of those other ones in here, I think. Yes. Okay. These are basically sapphire glass and smooth stone. Smooth stone is made from cobblestone. It's turned into stone. It's then turned into... Uh, whatchamacallit. Smooth stone. That stuff. Must be nighttime. Let's go sleep. There we go. Sleep, 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 sleep. Okay, that's still going there. We're going to need like another three or four of those for sure. Sapphire glass. If I recall sapphire glass, it's just, it's structural glass. It's not sapphire glass. Now sapphire glass is four glass and sapphire. And we have one glass here and no other glass. So we should start cooking up some glass. There we go. Um, redstone. I'm looking at things like, what do I need? What do I need? I need redstone. Making parts here. Because we have to do another green. So that would be a redstone and an osmium. Let's replace the one that we used here. Okay. There we go. Okay, so what is the bottleneck besides this machine? We got to get something better that works a little faster. Um, we need to get this piece, which takes three of those, which we're waiting on that. And then we need to make this is taking sapphire glass. And we have enough glass there. Make the smooth stone. What is a basic alloy smelter? Can we just make another one of those? Quickly. We got copper. See, we have to make another one of these things. I don't know. I'm not going to be able to do that right away. Boy, it would be useful though, wouldn't it? <laughs> okay, so we're going to get this third one here. This one will then allow us to create... Uh, we're making a refinery. The circuit board. Okay. And there it is. And then we are just missing the frame here. And this one we're missing that, which is missing the sapphire glass. I'm going to let this finish one here. And then I'm going to take this out and make sapphire glass. Okay, we got the glass in there. And we need a sapphire. Please have a sapphire. There's one. Okay, so we should be able to make this when that finishes. And then this takes more than ingots, but we have to do structural glass, which is steel and glass. We have to have four steel. And how much steel do we have? We have four steel. So we at least have that. Okay, we have this piece here. That's good. We need to basically make a bunch of that. Okay, there we go. 
the machine frame. We have that piece. And now all I got to make is the four structural glass, which we have. And we need three more redstone alloy ingots. And those are coming here. So we're just waiting on this machine, guys. And uh, hopefully then we'll be have a refinery. And with the refinery, I think we can start to look at maybe getting towards the plastic. We still have to make the solidifier and the other pieces that we need but to get that plastic. But we're getting closer. So probably the next episode, then we'll have that, which will be awesome. So let's just do this pretty quick here. I say pretty quick, and it's not very quick at all. <laughs> okay, so let's take a bucket, and let's get a tank out. Um, I'm going to put... Hmm. I'm going to take this machine out. And I know I took a piece power cable here. I'm going to put it there. And I'm going to put the machine back on the end. I'm going to put the refinery right here when we build it. What are we missing? Oh, nothing. Okay, uh, make that. Good, and then make the refinery, and there it is. We have a refinery. That's awesome. Now, I know we can pipe stuff into this. I, I get that, okay? But what I'm going to do is I'm just going to use the bucket, or the bucket, the uh, tank here. Just fill with oil. I'm going to use a bucket on it, and now you can see the bucket is filled with oil. I'm going to go here and put it in, and there is the oil. It's 1,000 MB of oil. And it's going to basically, I think, make the materials we need here. Which will be a diesel, I think it was, and ethane. And there we have diesel and ethane. Now, can we click on which one we want to take out? That's the question I've got. Um, and we can put them in canisters. That's a good idea, too. We have canisters. So let's see. Can we do the canister? Okay, see, it took from the first column... And then if I did this, it goes from the second column. There we go. We've got diesel and we've got ethane from the refinery. And all I need to do then is just take my my bucket and put it back in here. And it will do the job for me. So we have already solved the first problem. Okay, so let's just look before we go, guys. Again, let's go back and see what we really need. Do we get anything for that, by the way? Yeah, see, so we made oiled rig. We crafted the refinery. That's good. So the next thing is create a plastic sheet. And that's what we're going towards, plastic sheet. Let's bookmark that right now. Plastic sheet. Oh. Bookmarked. We need to get that from pellets. Pellets we get from polyethylene in a solidifier. And polyethylene we need from mixing water and ethane. Okay? So we got to get a mixer. So mixing is next. That'll be in the next episode. And a solidifier. So hopefully we will be able to get the plastic sheets in the next episode. Okay, guys? I sure hope you like this video because it's been a little bit of work, but at least we now know what's going on. Hey, if you do like this video, please click that like button. If, if you have any comments, put them down in the comment section. And if you'd like to be notified of the videos that I produce, please subscribe to this channel. And don't forget to hit the little bell icon so you get all the notifications, okay? Thanks, guys. Have a great day. Bye.